come on now. It's time to get up. You're making me bored. Sitting here, watching you, waiting. Didn't your mother ever teach you? It's not good to keep a lady waiting. Where are your manners? After all. Aren't you supposed to be the hero of Gotham? I see you're waking up. Good. I was getting bored. But now, now you and I can have some fun. So, what's the matter, Bat? You don't recognize me? <laughs> I mean, after all, you did go ahead and hit your head pretty hard there. Oh, you really shouldn't be slipping and running into ladies' bats. Oh, I suppose it was Bat Squared. <laughs> Get it? Because I hit you with my bat. Oh, come on now, that's a joke. Jokes are meant to be funny. You should laugh more. Smile. It makes life more fun. Why so serious, as Mr. J would say. There we go. I think you're recognizing me. Good. It's me, Holly. I guess I should reintroduce myself since this is technically the first time I get to see your face. <laughs> oh, yeah. Your mask is right there. So, hiya, I'm Holly, Holly Quinn. It's nice to meet ya, Bruce Wayne. Mm. And who would have thought? Bruce Wayne. Big, important businessman. Behind the bat mask. <laughs> Color me surprised. But here we are. Oh, you can try and move, but, uh, you see, so I already took care of that. Didn't want you going anywhere. Causing any problems for me. After all, I'm using you as a gift to get back on Mr. J's good side. He seems to be mad at me, though rightfully deserved. But I thought, hey, if I bring him the bat, he'll love me again. So, you're a bit tied up at the moment. I hope you understand. You can keep squirming, but I tied it nice and tight. You're not going anywhere. At least not anytime soon. So. There's also the matter of what's down below you. Yeah, I know you can't really see being all tied up and whatnot, but uh, why don't I just clue you in a little bit? See this year's poker chip? One could say, you're gambling for your life. And me, Holly, well, I'm the dealer. You hear that? That's the sound of fun. We're betting now, playing big games. That splash? That's the sound of a piranha. Piranha pond, I mean. The piranha would sound more like <laughs> But that, that splash, no, no, no. That's the little pond you're dangling over. Well, more of a pool, if so fact so. You're above some body of water with some piranha. 
and they're hungry. Just like I. But you see, I'm more hungry for knowledge. They're more hungry because, you know, they're just killer instincts. But, uh, we can make a deal, you and I. What do you say? Oh, come on now. You really think you're gonna survive that? After all, you're a bat who's lost his wings. At least for the time being. So, why don't you and I just have a little chat? Come on. Mano y mano. I mean, it's not often you and I get to spend so much alone time together. I'd really like to learn more about you. Oh, play nice now. I think we could be good friends, you and I. You see, I'm gonna hand you over to Mr. J. But first, I wanna make sure you tell me everything I need to know about Gordon, everything behind the scenes, where's your bat cave, Etc. You understand. Oh, fine. Not going to talk. Well, I suppose we'll do this the fun way then. Hmm? I do love games. Do you love games? Here. Bruce. Can I call you Bruce? I'll call you Bruce. You know what? That seems a little weird. I'll just call you Bat. Listen here, Bat. This here is my secret weapon. It's a truth serum. I took it when I was working in the asylum. Yeah. We used to give them pe some people these drops every now and then to get more information from them. People who didn't want to talk. Now, it wasn't considered morally ethical. So, uh, it wasn't used all the time. But, uh, considering you don't want to talk to me, and I've given you plenty of chances, we're just going to use a couple of drops. What do you say, bat? Good. And if you're a good bat, I don't have to introduce you to my other bat. Again, sorry about the first time. We kind of needed to get you back here and tie it up. <laughs> so we could hang out. <laughs> get it? Because you're hanging out. Yeah. Yeah, that was, in, that was in poor taste, wasn't it? It's a bit awkward now, ain't it? True Sierra. Yeah. So I'm just going to give you a couple drops, all right? Listen, this is really like my first big uh, alone uh, kidnapping. So if you could just kind of roll with it, yeah. I'll get better, I promise. And just learn it, learn it, learn it. Mm. Right, anyway. Here we are. Now, you're kind of hanging pretty far away and season as I don't want to become dinner. I'm going to go ahead and try to pull you in here. I mean, I know I do be looking like a snack, but uh, that's not really what I was hoping for. Here we are. You just open here up. Good. That should do it. Yeah. All right. And we'll just give that a moment to kind of kick in and do its job. Shouldn't take too long. Should be kind of quick. Like my ex. No, not Mr. J. I should hit you with my bat for even saying it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. At least you got a joke in. Alright. Sure. 
should take too long, yeah. Better watch your tongue. Now. We'll give it a couple seconds here. One. Two. Three. Let me take a look at yours. If it's starting to take effect, your pupils should be enlarged. So, I'll take a look and see how your eyes are dilating. Now that PhD still comes in handy. Though, when I took a spill into that vat over there, can't say I didn't lose some stuff out the other year, if you know what I mean. It's not all up there now. Some of it is, and that's some of it I'm going to use now. So, if you could just sit still there, well, you kind of don't really have a choice, but if you kind of just hang still there, yeah, and uh, stay here. I'd say don't move your head, neck, or shoulders, but that little tied up thing, yeah. All right, here we go. Okay. Well, it seems like it's taken effect a bit, but you're a lot stronger than you look bad. Hmm. All right. Hmm. We may have to do this the hard way. Well. You see, you can take it orally, but it can take a little bit longer to hit your system. Or sometimes you need a bigger dose. There's also the other fun way where we put a suppository in. Well, fine, if you're not interested in that. I can go ahead and inject it. Mm-hmm. Might be the easier way, too, since you're all tied up. All right. Let's try giving you a little injection, shall we? Now it'll be quick. And then we have some questioning. What's the rush? Sometimes I just like the sounds of things. It's the sensories in me. You know? That whole asthma thing. You've heard about it, right? Sweeping the internet. Yeah. Sometimes I just like to play around. And I mean, it's either this or Piranha Pond. So, take your pick. Now. We're gonna go ahead and start by disinfecting the area. I mean, I'm probably just going to kill you, but on the off chance I decide not to, I want to make sure you don't get sick. So. You're acting shocked? Just because I'm a bad guy doesn't mean I'm a bad person. We all have our things. Shouldn't be so quick to judge, Bat. Now, hold still here. Yeah, 
have that on here. That should do it, and yeah, I have this here syringe and the true serum. Well, no, I can't tell you what it's made out of. It's giving away my trade secrets. What does it look like? I took it? No. Get some out here. Here we go. All right. Now the fun part. Hold still for me. Two, three. There we go. That's not so bad, is it? Now, that should hit you a lot quicker. So, count to ten here. One, two, three, four. Eight, nine, ten. All right. Now look here. Oh, you responded so nicely. Seems to be working. Good, good, good. good. And your eyes look enlarged, which is a good sign. All right. You know, let's test one more thing. You could just follow this light with your eyes and your eyes only. Yeah, here we go. Good, 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 good. Very good. Let's test it out here. What's your name? Bruce Wayne. Good. And What's your alias? Batman, good. Mm, let's test it out. Okay, what's another fun one? Do you think I'm cute? Oh, stop. You flatter me. <laughs> oh, but don't let Mr. J hear you saying that. Now, where is your back cave? I see. Interesting. And, uh, is there anything I should know about? What are you hiding? What is your weakness? What do you mean you can't tell me? You just told me everything else. Oh, I see. Hmm. You've been trained against stuff like this. You have words around it. Fascinating. Hmm. Let's just see if I can get it out of you. How about with some tickle torture? Tickle, 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 tickle. So, what are you hiding? Come on, you can tell me. I'm your friend. Polly! Jay? Where's Polly? Huh. I was just saving him for you. Hold on. You wait right here.
Ray at 70. 